Hello everyone, this is Sudhir and welcome to my class. Now I am going to teach you about the number system. In the number system, especially about the place values. And you know what is the present population of India, that is in 2020. Yes, that is, here I am writing the number, you try to read this number. Yes, and here is the number. This is the present population, that means the population of India in 2020. Can you read this? Yes, so now here I will show you the numbers, that means the number is in which place. So using the international system. So in the international system, we can take the first number is in one's place, this is the tens. This is hundreds, it's a thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, this is millions, ten millions, hundred millions, and this is in billions. Yes, now it is easy to read the number that is. And you can check once this is completely belongs to one's place. That means it is 385. And this is belongs to the thousands place. And this is millions. And this is the billions place. So what is the number here? Yes, it is 1 billion. Three hundred and eighty millions three hundred and eighty millions and 4 is there in the thousands place so that it is 4000 300 and 85 So the number is 1 billion 380 million 4385. So now we can check the number uh, that means it's a face values and place values. Can you tell me what is the face value of this number? Yes, here is the face value is Place value is 8 and the place value is the number is there in tens place 5 is in ones place and 8 is there in the tens place so that the place value of the 8 is 8 into 10 that is 80 and do you know what is the face value of this number the face value of the number here it is 3 here is the face value is 3 and the 
प्लेस वैल्यू इज द थ्री इज देर इन द प्लेस हंड्रेड मिलियन सो दट हंड्रेड थ्री इंटू हंड्रेड मिलियन दट इज थ्री हंड्रेड मिलियन Yes, it's ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, millions, ten millions. So we need one more zero. That is three hundred millions. So after every three digits, you can use the commas. Now this is three hundred millions. Now I'm going to teach you about Indian system. The same number. How can we read in the Indian system? The last digit is as usual. We can take once. This is the ones, and the next one, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Next one is lakhs, ten lakhs, crores, ten crores. And this is hundred crores. So how can we read this number now? This is one hundred and thirty-eight crores. One hundred and thirty-eight crores. And there is no lakhs in the number. So this is the lakhs place. In this lakhs place, there is no number. Complete is a zero. And this is a thousands place. In the thousands place, we have only four, so that it is four thousand. This is a four thousand. And it's a three hundred and eighty-five. So we can write in words also. This is one hundred and thirty-eight crores, four thousand and three hundred and eighty-five. This is Indian system. Now we will discuss about their face values and place value. Do you know what is the face value of this number? The face value is. As usual, eight. And what about it? Place value. The place value of the number here. Place value is eight. Is there in tens place? So that it is eight tens are eighty. And do you know what is the face value of this eight here? Yes, it is. The face value is the same. That is eight. But the place value is. What is the place value of the number? This eight is there in the crores place, so that it is eight crores. But how can you use the commas to represent the number? So first three digits after a commas means it's completely ones place, and the next commas you can use for after the hundreds place, next after the lakhs. Now it is a crore, so it is eight crores. So I hope you understood how to uh, recognize the number and how to read the number in the both that means international system and Indian system. Now we will discuss about how to expand the number. For suppose a number we are taking like forty three thousand eighty five. So how we can expand it? The four is there in the place of see this is in the ones place, and the next one is in the tens place, and here zero is in the hundreds place. Now the three is in thousands. Now 
the finally the 4 is in 10,000 place got it now how can we represent this one means how can we expand the number that is 4 is there in 10,000 place so that you can multiply by 10,000 plus 3 is in thousands place so 3 into thousand plus 0 is there in hundreds place so 0 into hundred and actually we no need to write this 0 into hundred just we can leave the place and next one here 8 is there in the tens place so we write 8 into 10 plus 5 is there in unit place so that it is 5 into 1 so this is the number how we can expand so how to expand the number now i'm going to take here another one that is already that is in expanded form so how can we write from expanded form to this shortest form that is first suppose a number we have like 5 into 10,000 4 into 1,000 3 into 100 plus 2 into 10 plus 7 into 1 that means how the numbers they can ask 5 is there in 10,000 so that it is 50,000 and 4 is there in the thousands place so that it is 4,000 and 3 is there in hundreds place so that it is 300 plus 2 is there in the tens place so that it is 20 and 7 so this is the expanded form so how can we write in the shortest form so as we know that the 5 is there in the tens 10,000 places so the number we can write with 5 is in the tens thousand place so before the 10,000 we have a thousand place so in the thousands place we have the 4 is the number so that we can write a 4 so 4 before next one we have there that is the hundreds so that hundred is 3 so 3 is in hundreds place next the 2 is there in the tens place so that we can write the 2 and the finally the 7 is there in the ones place so that it is 7 so finally the number is 54,327 so this is the model how to expand a number and expanded number how to write its shortest form